Hello, everyone. It's my honor to participate in this year's White House Tribal Nations Summit. As Commerce Secretary, I want to acknowledge that the Commerce Department recognizes tribal sovereignty and self-governance. And I want to highlight our entire department's commitment to ensuring that tribal communities have the resources they need for economic growth. That commitment starts with high-speed internet. For too long, tribal communities have been cut off from the benefits of reliable, affordable internet connections. But that's changing. Through the Tribal Broadband Connectivity Program, we've awarded over $1.5 billion to more than 100 tribal entities to expand high-speed internet network deployment and digital skills training. These grants underscore the Biden administration's unprecedented commitment to closing the digital divide in Native communities. I'm also pleased to announce that the Commerce Department is signing on to the Joint Secretarial Order committing to tribal co-stewardship of federal lands and waters. It's going to ensure that our department, through NOAA, is furthering co-stewardship goals in the management of waters, fisheries, and other resources of significance and value to Indian tribes. I'm also thrilled that the Commerce Department has brought on Sean DeShane to serve as our Director of the Office of Native American Business Development within the Office of the Secretary, a position that had been vacant for more than a decade. The Office is elevating our Department's work in Indian Country and aligning our efforts with President Biden's strong agenda for tribal nations. Our Department's commitment to tribal communities doesn't end there. Our bureaus are working on multiple fronts to connect tribes to funding for long-term economic development. Our goal is to serve as many tribal nations as possible with the funding we have. We look forward to working with the tribes, industry, and across governments to create the conditions to foster economic growth in tribal jurisdictions. Together, we will bring opportunity to our tribal communities and ensure that tribal businesses and workers are equipped for success. A healthy and successful Indian country is at the heart of a prosperous American economy. Thank you.